O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. O Lord, the path of suffering trod, and since his blood for man has flowed, tis meet that man should yield to God the life he owes. Alleluia. No shame to own the crucified. Nay, tis our immortality that we confess our God who died and for him die, Alleluia. Beholding his predestined crown, into death's arms the martyr goes. Dying he conquers death o'erthrown, o'erthrows his foes, Alleluia. Lord, make us your own soldiers true. Grant us brave faith, a spirit pure, that for your name, your cross in view, we may endure. Alleluia. My soul clings to you, my God. For your sake, my body was stoned. O oh God, you my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you. Like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary. To see your strength and your glory. Your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you, on you I muse to the night. For you have been my help, and the share of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you, your right hand holds me fast. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. My soul clings to you, my God. For your sake, my body was stoned. Stephen saw the heavens opened, and he entered in there. Blessed is the man for whom the heavens stood open. O oh, all you works of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you angels of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you, the heavens of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. And you, clouds of the sky, O oh, bless the Lord. And you, all armies of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you, sun and moon, O oh, bless the Lord. And you, the stars of the heavens, O oh, bless the Lord. And you, showers and rain, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. 
And you all you breezes and winds, oh bless the Lord. And you fire and heat, oh bless the Lord. And you cold and heat, oh bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you showers and dew, oh bless the Lord. And you frosts and cold, oh bless the Lord. And you frost and snow, oh bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you night time and day, O oh, bless the Lord. And you darkness and light, O oh, bless the Lord. And you lightning and clouds, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. O oh, let the earth bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you mountains and hills, O oh, bless the Lord. And you all plants of the earth, O oh, bless the Lord. And you fountains and springs, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you rivers and seas, O oh, bless the Lord. And you creatures of the sea, O oh, bless the Lord. And you every bird in the sky, O oh, bless the Lord. And you wild beasts and tame, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you children of men, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. O oh, Israel, bless the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. And you priests of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. And you servants of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. And you spirits and souls of the just, O oh, bless the Lord. And you holy and humble of heart, O oh, bless the Lord. Ananias, Azarias, Misael, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise for ever. Let us praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. To you be highest glory and praise for ever. May you be blessed, O Lord, in the heavens. To you be highest glory and praise for ever. Stephen saw the heavens opened, and he entered in there. Blessed is the man for whom the heavens stood open. Behold, I see the heavens thrown open, and Jesus standing at the right hand of God. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker, let sons, sons exult in their king. Then praise his name with dancing, and make music with timbrel and tar. For the Lord takes delight in his people, he crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be in their lips, and a two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations, and punishment on all the peoples. To bind their kings in chains, and their nobles in fetters of fun. To carry out the sentence we ordain, this honour is for all these faithful. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Behold, I see the heavens thrown open, and Jesus standing at the right hand of God. It is not right for us to neglect the preaching of God's word in order to handle finances. So then, brothers, 
choose seven men among you who are known to be full of the Holy Spirit and wisdom, and we will put them in charge of this matter. We ourselves then will give our full time to prayers and the work of preaching. The whole group was pleased with the Apostles' proposal. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. He is my salvation, the Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. The gates of heaven were thrown open for Saint Stephen, who was the first follower of Christ to receive the martyr's crown. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us the mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant, as he promised by the lips of any man, those who were his prophets from of old, a Saviour who would raise from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father, to grant us a tree from fear, and save from the hands of our foes. We might serve him in holiness and justice, all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins. The loving kindness of the heart of our God he visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty. To his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The gates of heaven were thrown open for Saint Stephen, who was the first follower of Christ, to receive the martyr's crown. Let us give thanks for Saint Stephen, whose life on earth was lived in the service of Christ and who came at his death to witness to Christ with his blood. We give you thanks, O Lord, for all who have found the freedom to lay down their lives for your sake. We give you thanks, O Lord, for all whose desire for you has brought them through death with a joyful heart. We give you thanks, O Lord, for all who have followed through suffering the way of the cross. We give you thanks, O Lord, for all who have undergone martyrdom for the gospel. We give you thanks, O Lord, at the Saviour's command and for my divine teaching. We dare to say, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth 
as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Give us grace, Lord, to practice what we worship. Teach us to love our enemies as we keep the feast of St. Stephen, who prayed even for the men who stoned him to death. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.